What's happening everybody? Mark Mude, checking in with something wholly new for you. Wholly new for me. Let's first, let's say it's Happy Monday, March 25th, 2019. I'm doing a new thing here and I'll explain it as I go. Let me start by saying I quit my job and decided to go on a 500 mile walk. Seems reasonable. My Fitbit app says I've taken zero steps. So we're going to go ahead and press start workout. I quit my job because, uh, well, it's hard work. I had a back injury. Couldn't move very well for about a week. And I decided I need to find some lighter work to do. 12 foot 2 by 10s, 4 foot by 8 foot sheets of 3 quarter inch decking, half inch drywall. That's a young man's game there. I'm 50 years old. So I'm going to do lighter work. Can't work with that heavy material, I don't think, anymore. I do know that I want to walk to get in shape, to be outside. I love, I love to go walking. This is my newest idea. I'm starting up a channel called Suburban Hiker. That's me. I love hiking, walking, hiking. Might even get into backpacking, we'll see. Today I'm just walking around in my subdivision because that's what I have time to do. There's other times I'll hike in the uh, county parks, state parks, city parks, trail hiking. I love that kind of stuff. Every now and again I need to throw a backpack, carry food because I'll be gone for five, six, seven hours. Plan to hike on bike paths, river walks. I'll even do some urban hiking, go downtown. I do a little bit of walking around down there anyways. I'm gonna walk 500 miles. I know it seems like a long way, but it's not. I know it seems long for people who don't walk much, for the experienced hikers, especially people that through hike the big trails, like the Appalachian Trail or Pacific Crest Trail or the Continental Divide Trail. Those, those trails are a couple thousand miles, but, when you're through hiking, you're doing that for several months on end. Man, I hope to be able to do that someday. If I have a bucket list hiking those trails, those are probably all that's in the bucket list. Hopefully someday I can do that. I don't know. Going somewhere and not working for six months or so and still being able to pay bills is kind of a tricky thing for me to figure out. Some people can figure it out, but not everybody's able to do things that way. So I mentioned quit my job due to the... Uh, heavy nature of the work. I build trailers. I work in the RV industry. Recently I've been building mobile offices and modular units. They're not really towables. They're towed to the site, but you're not dragging those beasts around behind your car. These things are built out of much heavier material than your travel trailers. Tow behind type stuff. Literally can be back-breaking work. <laughs> I know it's taken a toll on my back over the years. Every now and again, my back goes out and I'll be bedridden, or floor-ridden actually, for several days on end. I'm pretty good at treating it. Lots of ice and heat for the back. Work on posture, of which I have terrible, terrible posture. I think that comes a lot from years upon years, actually decades, of uh, guitar playing. Sit there curled over a guitar, playing for hours on end. But that's what I like to do. Woo woo, look at me go. About a tenth of a mile away from finishing my second mile of a 500 mile walk. Almost three miles. It's getting close. Total distance three miles. Total time 58 minutes and 21 seconds. Split pace 18 minutes 57 seconds per mile. Look at that. Three miles. See how easy that was? I only have 497 more miles to go. So there you go. How easy was that? First three miles in my 500 mile walk. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Ring the bell to get the notification so you'll know what's going on. I'm checking out. It's the Suburban Hiker. We'll see you in the next video.